Hey, I'm Tom Sanford, and we're here at the Wallace to see my painting of Rashid Wallace. Uh, the Princess Anjali show is about celebrities like Tom. <laughs> you are, you are. <laughs> um, my name's Tom Sanford, and I'm an artist. Uh, I don't think I'm a celebrity, but a, maybe a, a local notable living in um, Harlem, the west side of Harlem in New York, New York, in the United States. Well, for the past uh, 44 years or so, I've been making paintings and drawings and uh, trying to be an artist. And so I just kept on drawing and I, I um, got to a point where I had to either become an artist or be homeless. <laughs> My first uh, solo exhibition was back in 2001 in Tokyo, Japan. And that one was uh, particularly fun because I had just met my then girlfriend, now wife, um, Alexandra, and I asked her to come with me. And after only dating for maybe two or three months, and she came with me, and I knew that we would get married someday. Ah, um, this is beautiful. I want to just um, sort of use my drawing hand and the mistakes I make to sort of uh, in, in my drawing to make the painting feel more like the personality of the person. Um, bonjour. <laughs> uh, my name's Lauren Lynch um, and I live in West Harlem uh, and I own three businesses on Broadway in between 148th and 149th with my partner. Bonjour. So this is a Cleveland sports bar. My partner Chad is from Cleveland. So I was like, is it okay if we have like a New York Knicks player on the wall? So, uh, well, and the other thing I'm part of is the, the Broadway malls. Um, so the, the malls that run from 72nd up to 168th. And through my friendship with Avi, we ended up pitching the art committee at the Broadway Malls Association. And that's why we have all these massive birds that Nick Holliber did. Uh, starting at 72nd, all the way up to 168th. I uh, could not get out of it. <laughs> but I just knew, I knew it was right, even just walking around and different people that I spoke to. The first time I came here was like nine years ago. And, you know, I moved here at that time and it just really, a lot of serendipity came, came into place that this is where we were supposed to be. Yes. Uh, it was basically not my idea. It was Tom's idea, and he uh, calls me up. He says he wants to do something like this, and I said to him, well, that's great, but Tom, I might not like it at all. And he agreed that, you know, he's going to take the risk for doing the work, basically, but he thought it was very important based on our history, and... Um, he came over and he took a bunch of pictures. Then he went off and, and did this, which of course I loved. <laughs> ah, this is great. This is good news. <laughs> so it's a complicated installation. And, and we basically we had other Picasso doves in the collection, mm -hmm. but we thought this was the most appropriate. And I think it's perfect. Um, I think that's what art should do it, it 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 shouldn't be explained too much you know and i mean there's other work here about me not a lot but if i have a birthday or something sometimes the artist does this or they might give me a bottle of my fav favorite beer peroni <laughs> <laughs> I thought this was kind of like um, how Apple computers will buy all their, um, you know, their chips and processors and have them all made over in, in China by, by these um, inexpensive labor. And then they bring it over here and they put their intellectual property on it. And then it's suddenly worth thousands of dollars. So that's what makes this unique for our time. Mm -hmm. Yes. It's a new sound, a new... You, you can't, everybody can't be Edith Piaf, right? No, of course not. You, everybody there, would like you, to, you, but you, no. You, they're wannabes if, the, if, if that's what they do. Yes, yes, okay? yes. Okay, so I'm great. If you want to add something or continue, I would be happy. Well, you can look around if you want. Yes, uh, I want. I would love it. Here, there's more in, in the other room here. 